Now here's a tough pill to swallow. Most kids growing up nowadays know Billy Ray Cyrus as Hannah Montana's dad. Or worse, the guy who hopped on the remix of Old Town Road. But for the rest of us, the name means a whole lot more. But recent news is showing a whole new side of Billy Ray. He's divorcing his stunning young wife after just a year and a half of marriage. Now he's claiming she's a fraud and a scam artist with a dark hidden past. While she's saying he's an evil man who wants to destroy her. I mean, talk about an achy breaky heart. Don't tell my heart, my achy breaky heart. So who's telling the truth? Who's lying? Is there any way to know? Well, either way, you'll end up knowing a lot more about Billy Ray and the mysterious Fire Rose than you ever bargained for. So let's dive in and go find out. What, what happened? happened? Billy's Background Over the last few years, Billy Ray Cyrus has spent more time on TMZ than CMT. You almost forgot the guy is a country musician, but man oh man, when he was in his prime, he could write some hits. With Achy Breaky Heart, Billy Ray was the guy who brought the line dance back. And when everybody thought he'd just be a one hit wonder, he dropped a terrific second album too. Then, okay I'll admit it, his career took a bit of a dip. But he kept busy, building himself an acting career starring on shows like Doc and yes, Hannah Montana. But all this time, Billy Ray lived a life behind the music and it was way crazier than you would imagine. Dating History From 1986 to 1991, Billy Ray was married to Cindy Smith, who co-wrote two songs on his first album, Some Gave All. But the relationship was less Barbie and Ken and more Bonnie and Clyde. They spent less time having long walks on the beach and more time doing drugs. Lots and lots of drugs. Cindy even gave him permission to hook up with women at his shows, but surprise surprise, that created problems in the relationship. Fellas, there's a lesson there. If your girl ever gives you a free pass, it's a trap. Now 1992 was the year Billy Ray's first album came out, when he went from being a loser sleeping in a friend's car to a worldwide star. But apparently that wasn't enough excitement for him, because somehow he found the time to have two kids with two different women. One was a random waitress, and another was a woman named Tish. Now we have to give Billy Ray a bit of credit here, he pledged to support the waitress and the kid he had with her. But he ended up sticking around with Tish, and in 1993 they were secretly married. They went on to have three kids, some of whom you might have heard of. I'm talking Noah, Brazen, and Miley. Fast forward. Now let's fast forward a few decades, the year 2010. A few lifetimes have passed over the years. Billy Ray and his kids have all taken their turns gaining and losing fame, and through all of that, Billy Ray and Tish stuck together. I put you high up in the sky and now. But something must have been going on behind closed doors, because in 2010, Billy Ray filed for divorce from Tish. But just a few months later, he changed his mind. Then in 2013, Tish's turn to file for divorce. But hold your horses, this time she changed her mind too. And it would take another decade for them to finally make up their minds. And in 2020, they separated. And in 2022, they divorced for good. Do you wish you had walked away sooner? Yes. I look back on it now, and I honestly don't know how I did. I was a single parent. I mean, after such a long and intense marriage, I'm sure it took Billy Ray years to completely recover and heal. And I'm sure it would be many, many years until... Huh? What's that? Oh, oh, okay, in 2022, Billy Ray announced he was engaged to a young woman named Fire Rose. And so goes it with the name Fire Rose, this is where things get interesting. Who the heck is Fire Rose? The gal now known as Fire Rose was born with the name Johanna Rose in Sydney, Australia to a family of symphony musicians. Apparently she didn't really care for kangaroos or violins because when she grew up she moved to LA to become a pop star. 
it was in LA that she changed her name to Fire Rose. So now let's jump ahead to 2010. Billy Ray is in full Miley's dad mode filming Hannah Montana when he takes a break from shooting to walk his dog Tex. This is when Billy Ray happens to bump into a young lady and Billy Ray thinks she looks like a star. He brings her onto the set of Hannah Montana, introduces her to the cast and crew, and gives her a few words of wisdom. And that's that, right? Well, no, not exactly. Let's jump to 2021. Billy Ray is in a creative rut and remembers the girl from the lot. He tracks her down and invites her to do a duet together. The song, New Day, let's play it for a sec. It's a new day, hearts awaken. It's a new day. Well, can you hear that? It's the sound of a flop, but they at least had a blast making it. So yeah, I know you know what comes next. In 2022, right after Billy Ray's divorce, I mean the ink on the paper hasn't even dried yet. Billy Ray Cyrus announces his engagement to Fire Rose. In just over a year, the entire thing has exploded. Billy Ray files for divorce just a year and a half later. I mean, it's quite literally insane. It usually takes married couples two years to hate each other. This isn't your typical divorce. Billy Ray says Fire Rose is a scam artist with a hidden history. Fire Rose says Billy Ray is an evil and abusive man. One of them is lying. I mean, this is where things get pretty weird. The Divorce on May 23rd, 2024, Billy Ray officially files for a divorce. More interestingly though, he requests that the marriage be annulled as if it never happened on the basis of fraud. So is it mail fraud or credit card fraud? Scamming people's grandparents over the phone maybe? Well, Billy Ray doesn't say. Then, not long after, he asked for a temporary restraining order from Fire Rose, accusing her of continuing to run up a tab on his credit card to pay for her lawyers and her lifestyle. We're talking a tab of a hundred thousand bucks. Well, um, Fire Rose has quite a bit to say about that. Fire Rose fires back. Like the reverse card in Uno, she immediately sues him back. Fire Rose says Billy Ray planned the entire divorce to destroy her and her career. She says he served her the papers on the day she was supposed to have an important surgery, a double mastectomy due to risk of cancer. And she says that he convinced her managers to cancel all of her tour dates, putting her deep in the hole. And as the cherry on top, Fire Rose accuses Billy Ray of abuse. Billy Ray's response. So does Billy Ray take responsibility and call it off? Of course not, he comes right back with even more charges. Now he says she abused him, verbally, emotionally, and physically. But that's not all. Finally, Billy Ray has to get more specific about the fraud charges. Now, Billy Ray's story goes like this. He and Fire Rose are at home and she's on the phone with the IRS. He happens to overhear her giving them her name and it's not Cyrus, it's Hodges. Billy is troubled and he does some digging and what he uncovers shocks him. He finds out he's not Fire Rose's first husband. She'd been married once before. Hodges wasn't her original name, but instead the last name of her ex. I know there's just too many names to keep straight. But because of this and other factors, Billy Ray claims that Fire Rose lied about her name and married him for the famous last name, hoping it would be a boost to her music career. But Fire Rose isn't finished yet. Now she comes back with an even darker tale, saying that Billy Ray wasn't who he claimed to be either. Fire Rose responds. As for the secret marriage, Fire Rose says she tried to talk to Billy Ray about it, but he refused to talk about past relationships. More importantly though, she accuses Billy Ray of being a controlling, abusive husband. She says he controlled who she texted and emailed, where she went and who she even talked to. She says he is an evil man and that they began to date in 2021 before he was even divorced. And just like that, in a few short, long weeks, both of their lives were torn apart. Nobody knows who's telling the truth, and it's not like they're going to kiss and make up. I'd like to tell you that I know who's telling the truth. I'd like to say that I've been camping outside the Cyrus home with binoculars, taking careful notes about what happens inside. But I can't seem to find my binoculars, and so unfortunately there is no way to know for sure, at least right now. 
one thing for certain though, if you're going to get married, take a few minutes to Google the person you're about to spend the rest of your life with, okay? It'll save you and your lawyers a lot of trouble down the line. All right, that's all for me. Now we want to hear from you. Get in the comment section and tell us your thoughts on the Billy Ray Fire Rose debacle. What's your favorite Billy Ray Cyrus song? Who out there has seen him perform live? And are you a fan of Miley? We really do look forward to reading your thoughts because hey, we make these videos for all of us. If you enjoyed it, please hit that thumbs up icon. It really helps. Make sure you're subscribed to the channel and come back often so we can keep telling you what, what happened? happened?